So let's talk a little bit about the importance of hydration, especially as it gets hot and humid outside. Water is an often overlooked nutrient when it comes to diet. When temperatures and humidity rise, it can be especially critical to ensure your children are getting enough fluids. Children are more easily prone to dehydration than adults, in part because they're always moving, and it's harder for them to disengage from their activity and stop to drink water. It's also harder for them to recognize when they are thirsty. So here are some tips for helping your child stay hydrated in the summer. If you have one of these coolers, and this can be a glass cooler, a plastic cooler, you could set a timer and have your kids take a water break every 30 minutes. And just place this outside. You want your kids to be able to access water without coming back and forth into the house a bunch of times. You can give each child their own personalized water bottle or colorful plastic cup. That way they're not coming in and using a thousand different cups during the day. Also, make sure to have plenty of fruits and vegetables available at snack and meal time. These foods are loaded with water and contribute as much as 25% of the body's daily hydration needs. So one way to get kids excited about drinking more water is to make some colorful infused waters. Let's look at some examples. And also remember you can use frozen, fresh, or canned fruits for water. So whatever you have available works great in this application. Let's go ahead and make an example of an infused water. We've got lots of options here, but one thing I think would be really colorful and pretty and great on a nice warm summer day is some watermelon and cucumber. Woo. We'll put some watermelon in there. This is a great thing to do if you have leftover fruit lying around. You can add it right in there. And we've got some cucumber. And then we'll just add a little bit of this mint. Kids can pinch this off, they can tear it, and add it right into this container. And then we just fill it full of water. Oh, and make sure it's closed. <laughs> For infused waters, you can try all kinds of combinations. What you can do here is really endless. Thanks so much for joining and we'll see you next time.